This video is about Richard Strauss. I explain the most important things about his life and his works. Richard Strauss was born in Munich on June 11, 1864. His father was a horn player and his mother came from a wealthy brewery family. He showed musical talent at an early age. He began playing the piano when he was only six years old. Strauss studied in Munich and Berlin. He learned from Hans von Bülow, a famous conductor and pianist. Bülow recognized his talent and encouraged him. Strauss composed his first works while still a teenager. Richard Strauss was a representative of late Romanticism in music. He was influenced by composers such as Richard Wagner and Ludwig van Beethoven. His music is known for its emotional and dramatic qualities. Some of his most famous works are also Sprach Zarathustra and Don Juan. These pieces are known for their complex orchestrations and profound themes. They are often used in concert halls and also in movies. Strauss was also a successful opera composer. His most famous operas are Salome and De Rosenkavalier. These works revolutionized the opera world and are still popular today. Strauss often collaborated with poets for his operas and songs. Hugo von Hofmannsthal was one of his most important partners. Their collaboration resulted in some of the most important operas of the 20th century. In his later years, Strauss turned again to instrumental music. He composed several symphonic poems and chamber music. Despite the political turmoil of his time, he remained a respected composer. Richard Strauss died on September 8, 1949, and his influence on music history is enormous. Many modern composers see him as a role model. His works are performed and studied all over the world. Strauss was not only a composer, but also a talented conductor. He led many famous orchestras and was known for his precise technique. He was also one of the first composers to take advantage of the recording possibilities.